Hi, this is Mark Delise, and I want to present to you some guru marketing tactics. When you see a lot of presentations online today, you'll notice that a lot of the call to actions are timed to a certain event. For example, a professional marketer does a video and all of a sudden the order button is timed to come into appearance when the call to action is taking place inside the video. So a lot of times you'll see the video and later on in the video towards the call to action, an order button will, will appear below the video. Or maybe it's an opt-in form, or maybe it's a graphic or a text link or what have you. Now the thing about this is that a lot of times these, these delay scripts, uh, first of all, they're hard to do on your own. Secondly, uh, they're, a lot of times they are tied into a WordPress theme. What I'm offering you today is a WordPress plugin that will do delay anything on your website and it's very easy to use. It works on any WordPress blog so it's not tied into a WordPress theme. It's it is easy to use and it works on pages, on posts, and in widget areas. So if you have a header widget area that you want to have an opt-in form delayed or a video delayed or maybe in a sidebar, it also works with that too. Let me give you a live demonstration exactly how easy this is to use and how well it works. Now here is an illustration. On this page here I have a video and let's just say it's going to auto start and so when a person visits your page the video is going to start playing and I have a call to action later on in the video. Now for illustration purposes let's just pretend that the call to action is 10 seconds into the video. All right, And at the 10 second mark there'll be a call to action, an order button, that appears underneath this video. Now I'll show you how easy this is to implement. All you need to do is go back to your WordPress uh, dashboard where your page is, and here is the uh, video, I'm using the traffic player, and just come down below this, and first of all I'm going to put a, uh, there's an icon that appears and says WordPress delay content, and you simply click on that, and a little pop-up happens, and all I do is enter the number 10, all right, just like that. And I simply just click Insert, and you'll notice that it adds some short code uh, right here. Now, it says Enter Text here, but I can put a video in there, I can put an Order button in there, and what I like to do is simply click the Enter button and come down here and then go again. Now, I can, I can take this and I can, I can take this and I can cut that and copy it into a widget and it'll work inside the widget areas. But for this post right here, I'm going to uh, stick an order button right here. So let me just replace this text and I'm going to come up here and I'm going to grab an order button. And uh, you can either manually add a order button or you know my theme has them as well. Um, let's say for example I'm going to use this one here. And of course you uh, put the URL, your checkout Right, you put your checkout checkout right here, your PayPal or what have you, right, right there, and you click on insert. All right, so that's going to be the order button, and the order button is going to appear 10 seconds after the browser start. Now, now watch this. All I need to do is click on update, and I will come up here. I will visit the page once again, and it's going to appear below the video. So let me just refresh this this browser. And then we gotta wait 10 seconds. Hi, this is Mark Delise, and this is the fourth video on the blog. And this is just an illustration video that I'm playing, but you'll see that the order button will appear. Sure. There it is right there. You see that? How the, uh, how the order button automatically appeared below that? So that's how easy that this works. And again, I can have the video delayed, an order button delayed, an opt in form delayed. Anything that I want to have delayed, I can put it right here. This also works in widget areas. And so, for example, You'll see here that in the widget area right here, all I did was add a text widget inside the sidebar. See the sidebar? And I added a text widget, and I put the title for illustration purposes, just delayed content to show you. And what I did is I put an iframe YouTube. I put a YouTube video in there, and all I did was, was take the short code from the, I copy and paste the short code from the visual editor to the widget area. Now once again you have to, when you're doing it in a widget area, uh, always remember you, f you have to, you have to um, click on this button here and click on insert and then cut it or copy it 
or cut it out of here and paste it inside your widget area. So it has to be uh, pasted, cut and paste from, a, from the visual editor for this to work. Um, now, once it's set up, obviously you click on save. Now you'll see the, the blog that I have it set up on and it's right here. Now you'll, now you'll notice that, uh, let me just refresh this blog page and wait 10 seconds. Here's right here and 10 seconds in, there's gonna be a video pop up right here inside the widget area. Okay, see that? And there, there's, the, uh, there's the video, YouTube video. So again, it works in widget areas and blogs and pages and posts, very easy to set up. And so this works like gangbusters and I highly recommend it. Again, this is a WordPress blood plugin, so you can, you can use it on any WordPress blog, a default WordPress theme, uh, what have you. And so this is Mark Delis signing off on a very good uh, plugin for your marketing strategies. Thank you.